What's going on everybody? It's lowwilly 618 bringing you guys a CSGO commentary? What? Well, the reason you're getting CSGO and not Call of Duty is, um, I haven't played on Xbox One in like a couple weeks. Um, I've actually switched over and joined the PC Master Race, um, as they like to call themselves. I know that's really a joke, but... I mean, it's kind of caught on, and you know, that's what everyone says it is, it's a PC Master Race. But yeah, I switched over to PC Gaming. Um, I was going to do an unboxing of the actual computer that I bought, but um, that kind of fell through. I filmed like half of it, and then I started playing my PC, and it got to this point where I've had the computer for a little over a week now, uh, maybe even two. And I've just been playing non-stop, live streaming games, um, started, you know, messing with settings to record games. And I got this little gameplay for you guys here. Uh, what kind of sucks about this is, this is CSGO, and I love playing CSGO. But what kind of sucks about this is, while I was testing the settings to figure out how I can get some smooth recording, 1080p, 60 FPS, and um, get it to where I can play on high settings, um, the game before this, before I got the settings that worked, um, I actually won a game of arms race. Um, it was my first win in arms race, and, but I couldn't release that footage because the footage of that it had like, too many stutters for me. Um, it wasn't a lot of stuttering, but it was just enough for me to go, eh, let's put that on the back burner. But anyway, you guys get this little arms race gameplay I kind of joined in the middle of. Looks like I'm playing bots, but there were some people in there, so... It's whatever. But anyway, let's talk about the transition to PC. Um, for those of you wondering, no, I did not build my own computer. I did not go out and buy separate parts because if I'm anything like my father, um, I know for a fact that I would probably screw things up if I was anything like him. And I am quite a bit like him. Um, I would have gotten incompatible parts. I would have, you know, fried something while trying to build it. Something wrong would have happened. Um, when it comes to building things, me and my dad, um, Murphy's Law is in full effect. So, anything I can go wrong will go wrong. And I didn't want to take that risk, especially with how expensive computer parts can be. I did not want to take that risk. So, I ordered my computer through a company called Ironside Computers. Um, you've probably heard of them if you guys follow the Call of Duty scene or really just any PC gaming scene. Um, Ironside Computers is, you know, one of the, um, top tier builders, um, out there. Um, they're not like Origin or where they do, um, very, very high-end stuff. But, um, they're kind of like I buy power. Except you, I think with... With Ironside PC, I think you have a little bit more control because I did shop around a bit um, to look at different price scales and whatnot. And it seemed like Ironside PC had a better um, better choice range, better um, better selection, if you will. So I went with Ironside PC, plus I had discount codes for them, so it kind of helped out a little bit, paid for the shipping. But I went Ironside PC and I bought the computer... Um, and what the components I chose for it were a Intel i7 6700K, which is quad core with hyper threading, um, all being cool, uh, cooled with a uh, maintenance free water cooler. Um, I got some sort of gaming motherboard that supports uh, SLI and um, is a gaming specific motherboard. And. Uh, I got a uh, EVGA GTX 980 Ti super clocked, um, and with the hardware, I may have been a little overkill. Um, it cost me an arm and a leg and half of my firstborn, but I, I'm pretty glad with my purchase. It runs games almost without effort, and I'm able to record, stream, and do all that fun stuff. And it's been nice because I've actually get to showcase some games that I really enjoyed playing for the past year or so, but can never record because my laptop was never powerful enough to do both at the same time. So expect to see some changes to the channel in regards to that. And before I let you guys go, um, because this is going to be a short video, before I let you guys go, I want you guys to know if you are looking for a Minecraft server, 
Go down in the video description below. I have a link to a new company called WTG Hosting. I know the owners. Um, they are really hoping to get this company off the ground. They're doing Minecraft servers for now, but they're hoping to expand to things like Gary's Mod and all sorts of other servers, server-based games. So if you guys are looking for a server, go down to this link below. I'll have my own personal affiliate link to them. And use the code WOOLLY, that's W-O-O-L-E-Y. And you guys will get 7% off your order. Um, these guys are trying to get off the ground. I'm doing the best I can to help them. You guys, if you follow me on Twitter, you've probably seen me tweet out this stuff already. But if you want to check it out, if you want, guys want a Minecraft server, go over there. Go down the link below and go and buy it. But anyway, guys, I'm out of time. Thank you guys so much for watching and listening. Remember to like, comment, share. Follow me on Twitter. And that's pretty much it. So I'll see you guys next time. My name's Little Lee 618 and I'm out. Peace.